Richards Wheeler. It's, uh, it's what it's cracked up to be. It was dispiriting when you're at 12,000 feet and you can't get any oxygen. I live in Breckenridge and I was struggling severely up there. Second yeah. year on the tandem. Last year, I remember dying at the top of Wheeler. Yeah. And we were doing better this year. We were doing a lot better this year. Took the time to eat some good bacon at the top. That was yeah. Nice. Daily Beer Willard. <laughs> we are gathered here today at this very inconvenient location, <laughs> but pretty spectacular place to be. We both knew we wanted to elope. We also really wanted to do this race. So it was kind of like a, why not do both? <laughs> Right after the aid station, there was this man and he was sitting on the trail and he said, you're almost done. And you are not done. You are totally not done. Sorry, I keep looking at the camera because I want to tell people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not done. <laughs> you're, you're not, not done. done. <laughs> Where'd you come to this road? race with a lot of the same people day after day and you get to talk to them and you get to know them. It's such a community, especially by the end. I absolutely adore this race. This is the fourth time I've done it. I always have a breaking point where I hate the race and I'm like, I'm never doing this again. But by tomorrow, I'm gonna probably sign up again. 